This is Dawn Olszewski and welcome to another episode of How'd She Do That? And today I'm going to show you a quick tip. The tip is on how to cut this cute little decorative edge. So let's get started. First thing you're going to need is a die cutting machine. I'm using the Big Shot. I've got my multi-purpose platform in there set to tab 2 so it's entirely closed. I'm putting in my bottom cutting plate and I'm getting out my framelits. The framelits that I'm using today are called the floral frames and I'm using the second lar largest one. Now what we're going to do to get our decorative edge is we want to do a partial cut. So I'm going to stick in this piece of cardstock which measures 3 inches by 5 inches and notice how I have this end of it sticking out of the, the die and this end is underneath the cutting edge because that's the only edge I want to cut. So now here's how I'm centering this or I should say positioning it. So I'm going to put this all the way to the top. This edge matches the top edge of the cardstock. And then I just want to center these two um, side to side with the cardstock. So that looks good. I'm going to let that rest there. I'm going to come in with my cutting plate on top. Now, before we run this through the Big Shot, this is where I'm going to give you a tip. So we'll pull this out and we only want to cut to right here. So I don't want to run it all the way through the big shot or I'm going to get um, this kind of oh embossed edge down here. And that might be great for another look, but not for the look that I'm going for. So we're just going to run it. We're going to do that partial cut by pushing it through till we see. See, it kind of clicks. Sometimes it doesn't click like that, but I can see that I'm partially through. I know that that edge that I wanted cut is in there, and voila, let's come in, and you can take a look here, and there we go. Isn't that great? So here's what it looks like when it's all cut, and I've just added to the, to the card and used a little bit of designer series paper. It was called T for Two. The flower here is also another big shot die. It is called Fun Flowers and the, the greeting, the happy birthday, comes from the blue ribbon set. Very cute. It's designed to work in this blue ribbon but I thought these images would be great in um, in the center of this flower as well. Finished it off with a little baker's twine and voila Kind of a quick and easy card, but of course this is a great technique. So look at your your dies, your framelits particularly, kind of outside the box. See what else you can create with them by doing the partial cutting trick. So be sure to stop by my blog at DoStampinWithDawn.com. I have a full supply list of this card. The link directly to it is in the um, description of this video. So thanks for stopping by.